and welcome to Becca's Toy Collection and welcome to today's Sylvanian Families. I have a figure unboxing review kind of video and I'm sorry if there's some noise in my background and uh, my guinea pigs are having some fun. Uh, but as I said I have this family pack right here and also a baby and this is the Bouquet Skunk Family I think it's called. So you can see them right here. It's an older set and they're a bit dark so you probably can't see that much when on the camera right there, but here is the packaging. It just has some Slovenian information. Slovenian families is a unique and adorable range of distinctive animal characters with charming and beautiful detailed homes, furniture and accessories. They live, work and play in the idyllic and wonderful land of Slovenia. So here you have some more example of some families that you could get or for some cases can get still if you look at the right places. Oops. So as I said, I have the skunk family and I have the baby in the pink outfit. There also is a baby in blue outfit. So yeah, I think I'm gonna start with the family and in this older package you can open them from the bottom or top. So let's see if I can get it out from here. Ooh, collector's club. So we do get a pamphlet, and it's actually an older pamphlet, since this is an older set. I love looking at this. Uh, hopefully you do too. I'll just give you a quick little overview. A lot of sets. Oh, this brings back memories. This was like... A lot of these things is from when I started collecting, because they had this mother at home, and, or like father at home, mother at home, babies at home sets. Uh, where they had these dogs. I don't remember what they were called. But now they have the bunnies, and I have this set. Oh, this is just <laughs> so no nostalgic. It's not that long ago, it's like five years ago, but still. It's quite nice to see some other sets and like some older sets. And a bit of like regret seeing like things I wish I could have gotten. Granted, when I started collecting Slovenians, I just bought the sets like from Sweden because I didn't, I didn't order anything online. Some of these sets I couldn't buy because I could never find them. So. But let's just take out these figures and then I will go through them one by one. Oh, they have these. Remember these? Oh, this is so old school. It's not that old school. I'm being a bit dramatic, I know. Uh, I just love Slovenians and it's nice to get some things that aren't in shops. Or, I bought this in a shop, but you know, in the normal toy shops. Probably didn't say, but I did get this from the UK Slovenian store, so I will leave a link to my like store video and like haul if you want to see that. Otherwise you can check out their web shop. Some of these things you can still, like the older things you can still buy in the web shop. So let's start with the father, and I think the most notable thing that I think about this family is that they, their face seems to be kind of like a small mold, like the face mold. I just had to take some figures out and see if it's actually the case. So I have the cow mother right here. I have the bear. Granted, I think this is a bear with a bit of a larger head mold. Here's the cat. And I think the cats are some of the smaller heads because of the giant ears. But you can still see that uh, this skunk's head is quite a bit narrower than this one, so I wasn't wrong, I wasn't imagining things, which is nice, saying some useful things. And you can see he has this two-piece outfit, so he has a quite bright uh, yellow overall with some red buttons and then just a brown shirt under. You can see his tail is quite thick, it is a bit messed up from, from staying in a box for too long. So I could fluff that up a bit, but it is super cute. I really like his colorings. Dark gray looks great, and I really like the light gray on here and on his nose. So this box do contain the little story underneath. So I'll just read what it says. And please bear with me. My English isn't always that good, and I do have a hard time reading English. So let's see. Father Stilton Boquette and his wife Rosemary run a pampering business. It does very well because all the Slovenian ladies adore Stilton. 
He's charming, so debonair. What's more, he has a wonderful soft French accent that the ladies think is so ever romantic. It just says pampering service. I'm wondering what that is. But that's our first figure. Of course, we have the wife right here. And she's in the same mold. There's no difference between those. But she has this super cute dress. And I really like her dress pattern, actually. It has this super, super there's soft green color, not sure how green it will show up in the camera. And then you also have some flowers and leaves. I really like this, it's quite a simple style of dress, but it's super cute. Again, her tail is a bit squished, but she looks really cute. And I, don't, I do think uh, that the dress doesn't fit quite as nice as maybe some of the others, because of the tail, the uh, the fastening up here kind of tugs it up a bit, which maybe I can like squish it around a bit more later. But I will read her description too, if you want to hear that. Mother Rosemary Bouquet is the business brains behind the pampering service, making sure all the clients are being looked after. So that was kind of a short and not that fun <laughs> description, poor Rosemary. But she is a really nice figure. She does seem to have a bit of a shave on f of her nose. Not sure how close she were to the pa package edge. If it has like smushed in her nose or if it's just some kind of factor thing. But she is still super cute. Of course we have two children from this set. First up we have the brother right here. And he does have some dents from the uh, strappings from the box. You can see right here. And a bit right here over the arm and such. He only comes with these little pants, which again, totally the area of style during this run of Slovenians. His hand is super super loose. Not sure if you can see that kind of sways a bit. Not super loose that it like shakes when I leave it alone, but a bit looser. He has some gold in his pants too. Not sure if you can see that shifting in the light. Of course, he has a little story too, and it says like this. Brother Sage Paquette also works in the family business cleaning and tidying, but only at the weekend and after he has finished all of his homework. So that's nice, helping out, but still doing his homework, which is important. So that's the brother. Of course, the sister, same mold, different clothes, and her dress is actually really cute. You can see again the dress style where they were just like a skirt and a little band right here. And again, you can see her dress doesn't fit her that well because it's kind of have to go under her tail to close, which kind of makes it go in this weird little angle. Well, it looks fine from the front, and I really do like the lace part right here and the little bead right there, so that's super cute. And she doesn't have, she does have a little mark right here from the strap, but not too much. You can see the little bow tie tied, probably. You can see that, I'm not sure, behind her tail right there. And her story is, Sister Jan Yasmin Bouquet loves perfume and is always trying out different brands at the shop. Her dream is to create one of her own perfume. So that's really sweet. I wonder what kind of pampering store does have perfumes. I wonder what shop they're working at. Now I have to check that out. I'm super curious. So that's the family. As I said, do you have the baby? Right here. I was kind of debating on getting the... If I was going to get the blue or the pink one. But I do think I have more blue ones than pink ones. So I thought it would be nice to change that up. I'm not sure why I have more blues, maybe because the pink ones sell out more frequently, but yeah, that's what I had anyway. So of course they come with this little creep right here, which uh, on this floor can't, I don't know, on this can't, but it's like a little wagon, not wagon, crib, stroke, no? When I, say, when I think of crib, I kind of think of those... Other beds, not sure what this is. Cradle? Is it a cradle? Maybe. You also get a little bottle right here. And you do get a lot of these if you buy these more babies. You have a ton. But here is the baby. She is so cute. She doesn't have any tail because she's super tiny, so that makes sense. But she's just adorable as compared to the sister right here. Oh my god, this is so cute. 
and compared to the mother. So these actually go pretty well together color-wise, even if the mother has a lot of green and other colors in her dress. She still have these pink flowers, so it makes them go quite nicely together. Here is the baby with his cute little face, and it's just adorable. So I'm super happy to get that. I will put the family all together. Let's see if they want to stand. Probably not. Because of their tail, it's pretty hard to stand them up, and I don't really have the patience to try to do that now, so I'll just use this. I'll just do it like that. So, super professional. I do think this is, as I said, not a family that's well matched in colors uh, because it's a bit all over the place. Even if the mother's dress has some pink in it, it doesn't go like super well with this dress. I, I mean, this looks cute together, but as a whole, it's a bit all over the place. And you have some red here, and some red here, and some red here, but it's not like a going theme throughout them all. I do really like this family and do think that their molds and their like coloring of their furs and everything is really nice but you know clothes wise not the best but I'm happy with it. Hope you're happy with it. Let me know if you do have this family and what you think of it and if not if you are interested in getting it if this is something you want for your collection. As I said, I got it from the Sylvania UK store. I'll leave a link to my video where I get these if you want to see that. But that's basically it for today. I do hope you like it. I do hope you want to see more. I will also leave a link to my Sylvania playlist. I do try to make or post a Sylvania video every Sunday, which is my Sylvanian Sunday. Sometimes it doesn't work out, but most of the times it does. Which means I have a ton of Sylvanian videos if you want to see that. But yeah, that's basically it. As always, do take care. Hope to see you soon. Bye.